Kevin Stefanski uh, met with the media earlier, talked about what getting Kareem Hunt back in the backfield would mean against the Steelers. Yeah, I think we'll see. Uh, like you said, I'm not rolling him out. want to see how he looks throughout the week. Um, if we can get him back, I think that'd be a big boost to our team. Uh, he's a great, great competitor. Um, so we're hoping that he can make it back. You know, Dearness has stepped up for us uh, in big, big moments and, and come through. Um, and having said that, I think all those guys are different. So if you don't have Nick, you're not going to replace Nick. If you don't have Kareem, you're not going to replace Kareem per se. These guys are great players. Uh, so Kareem has a, a different style than, than uh, each one of those guys. They all have their own flavor in terms of how they run, how, how they play. Uh, and certainly Kareem's style fits what we do. So if we are able to get him back, look forward to utilizing him. So welcome in Tim Bielek from the Plain Dealer and Cleveland.com. And Tim, um, I, I think the Browns offense, I think we have minimized how much Kareem Hunt means to them. I think their offense is just different when Kareem Hunt is able to play. No question about it. I mean, he, he's such a multidimensional player on this offense with his ability to run between the tackles, to get to the perimeter, and to be a weapon in the, in the passing game, particularly the screen game. You know, it's always one of those things where you, you don't know what you have till it's gone, and it's clear, you know, how impactful Hunt has been when he's been healthy, how much of a boost it's been to have him and Nick Chubb together. And if the Browns can get him on Monday night against Pittsburgh, that would be out. out outstanding for them because we talked about on Tuesday the Steelers in one of the one of the more surprising things of the season have the NFL's worst run defense so if you can have not one not two but three really good running backs out there that you can rotate and if this is the week that the Browns do what Browns Twitter has been asking them to do is run the football with frequency if you have three healthy backs to go at them and chip away at that defense that's a really good opportunity to you know, capitalize on that weakness of the Steelers' defense. Yeah, and um, and again, he's one of those guys that just seems to make everybody on the offense play a little better, a little harder. Everybody seems to kind of rally around him. 